What is happening with Splatoon SOS? Where is Splatoon SOS? Now if you don't know what I am referring to, at the start of the year on New Year's Day, on the Splatoon Japanese Twitter account they did post a Samurun image and what got everybody talking is in that image it did say 2020 in reflection in the water in the image it did say SOS save our salmons and this got everybody speculating on whether it was hinting at Splatoon 3. I talked about the possibility of it being a spin-off game or a Samurun DLC expansion like what we got with the Octo expansion for Splatoon 2. It could have been a DLC for Splatoon 2. That is what I did talk about in a couple of videos I made early on in the year. But the fact that we haven't seen it yet, what is happening with the game? Now there was one theory that SOS meant the release date of the 5th of May. I think it is a guarantee that is not happening now because if it was going to come out on the 5th of May we would have seen it in a direct so I guess there is two options in terms of what is happening right now with Splatoon SOS and the first option is that it is still real it is still a thing whether it is Splatoon 3 a spin-off game or DLC for Splatoon 2 but it will be revealed at a later date it will still be coming out in 2020 but they will be announcing it in the next Nintendo Direct, their E3 sort of equivalent. We don't know whether it will be in the same sort of time period of E3. It could be a couple of weeks after that, it could be a month, it could be two months. We just don't know at the moment. But there is the possibility that Nintendo could reveal it for later on this year in a future Nintendo Direct. It could still come out this year. Or I guess there is another possibility that it could come out next year. Although, why release a teaser on New Year's Day this year if it wasn't going to come out this year? So... Yeah, I guess in their sort of normal sort of September direct, they normally sort of talk about their next year games as well. Although in September 2019, we didn't really get too many games announced for 2020. Or maybe another option is that pretty much they have had to push it back until next year. It was planned to come out this year, but based on current events, they have had to push it back until 2021 so yeah we just yeah we just don't know what is happening at the moment i guess another sort of possibility is we read too much into the image i did raise the possibility in my other videos i did make on this topic early on in the year on splatoon sos that it isn't a sort of game it isn't anything to do with new DLC or new content for the Splatoon universe. It's got nothing to do with Splatoon 3 or a spin-off game or a DLC expansion. It was just artwork to celebrate the new year. That was pretty much it. That was all what it was, was just artwork. That would be really, really disappointing if that is the case. But the fact that it didn't appear in the direct, that is definitely a real possibility it would be a really disappointing sort of outcome i am definitely hungry for the next splatoon experience but i guess we will have to wait for the next splatoon experience whether it be until splatoon 3 or until a spin-off game does come out whether it be on the switch or on the next generation of Nintendo's sort of systems, whatever they do have planned. Like I said earlier, maybe they did have to delay it until 2021 due to current events and I really hope if we don't see anything this year, then that is the case because I must admit, my expectation for there being a Splatoon game this year 
was soul-led based on that image. So if that image did turn out to be not hinting at any new content, then my hopes for a new Splatoon game would definitely diminish. It really would falter a lot. But I guess there is quite a lot of time for us to get an announcement. We still have the next Direct in June. If it is to come out this year, then that would be the most likely time for a reveal if Splatoon SOS is real and is coming out this year. So yeah, let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below. What do you think is happening with Splatoon SOS? Do you still believe it is still new content for us to experience whether it be Splatoon 3 or all of the other options I did mention earlier? Or are you now leaning over towards it just being artwork? And yeah, let me know your thoughts on the prospect of not having a new Splatoon experience to play this year. Let me know your thoughts about that in the comments section below. And yeah, what I will be doing over maybe in a week's time, a couple of weeks time, I will be talking about another Splatoon 3 theory that I did mean to make in February, but just didn't have the time to make it in February or in March. And yeah, that video will be coming up soon on the channel, but that is pretty much it for this video. I will see you in another video soon, hopefully. Actually, just before I go, of course, if you do get any news on Splatoon SOS, then of course, I will keep you guys up to date on that news, on that information on the channel. I will, of course, discuss it in numerous sort of videos if it does require numerous amounts of videos to talk about it. But yeah, I will talk about any new Splatoon news on the channel, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I will see you next time.